I need to go to the fence and uh, sell my gold. Oh, oh there you good. are. A new patron. Welcome, welcome. All right, what do you have for me? Oh my goodness, what happened to you, dude? You kind of it doesn't look real. Three hundred big ones. Oh. Fuck yeah, dude. Oh, I'm making that big boy money. No questions asked. Not bad, this. Damn, he gives me a lot. Thank you very much, man. Woo! I got a thousand dollars now. Good doing business with you. What do you have the What do you have to buy? Psycho mask. What? <laughs> What? I'd like the, the psycho well, mask, please. It. What the fuck, dude? I'm gonna become Jason? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god! It's like Jason meets Hannibal Lecter. There's fucking holes in it. That's fucking creepy, man. I look kind of badass with this, though. This is pretty good. I like that. All right. Uh, down here to the grays. I'm looking for my friend. Gavin, you think all this Lamorne air is Gavin. free for you? <laughs> Gavin. Uh, where the hell are you? What's up, buddy? Hello, mister. Listen, have you seen... I'm looking for my friend, Gavin. I don't know any Gavins, I'm afraid. English bloke. You Lovely look fella. Like you might need he went missing, and uh, set you straight. now I'm all alone. Good luck. Be smart and keep dumb, okay? That's really that's, all I uh, have to say? That's too bad. No, I'd like to help, but, like, I don't. Gavin! I mean. Gee, I would. I'd like to help. Gabba! <laughs> okay, I guess I won't help you then. <laughs> hey, wait, I want to, I would like to help you. Oh, that's really... Gavin! Gav! In! <laughs> Where the hell are you? <laughs> what the fuck? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Gav! And! <laughs> well, I got another new mission here now. I got a Dutch mission now, randomly, that popped up. He needs to leave me alone. Yeah. Go drink the moonshine, you damn lout! You stay off our land, <laughs> goddamn! Yeah! I'm going for you! Appreciate the help, mister! <laughs> I just fucked that guy over. <laughs> what do you want, boy? This here the Gray Plantation? Hey, look, I've been helping the sheriff with some trouble. Wanted me to have a word with a few of the folks on the property here. <laughs> Damn it, Lee. All right, have a word. But I ain't got the time to help you. Obliged. Who do I ask? In my creepy mask. Hey, uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region and, uh, I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. Okay. I think he'll talk to somebody as hideous as me. That's why I wear this mask, because I'm ugly as fuck. <laughs> Is him? Huh. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. X 
Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I guess. We don't get a lot of traveling men here, and suddenly there's a whole phalanx of mysterious but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? Hey, my I'm mask! Just looking for work? Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. The thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaites. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. Love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. He's getting all love sweaty and shiny while he's talking about this. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Gray, son of Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, I'm sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved. <laughs> Gang feuds. It seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We grays, Ooh. we've always got money. No brains mine, but money. Well, in that case... I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. Damn, he just had it on the ready. Holy shit. Oh, look out for their guards. Mm-hmm. I'll look out for their guards. I'll be sure to uh, beat this shit out of them. <laughs> Horse! Horse! Do I actually have the bracelet on me? I don't think I actually have the bracelet on my person. I have his letter. It's a unique item that I cannot read. Yeah, let's try to look into it. Horse! God damn it. I kind of like this area down here, though. This is very nice. More likely to be spotted on horse. Oh. Do not attack the guards. I have to stop gods. A sneak mission. Don't worry, I can see the gazebo from here. <laughs> How's that not it? Is it a different one? Jump over. It was really easy to sneak in here, I'm just saying. Are you Penelope Braithwaite? Well, yes, I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And. I'm sweaty. A gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, it's not from me, it's from. Uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, he is so. Strange. Yes, he's a little strange. How but sweaty also I am. So human. The rest of our families are stuck in the dark ages or well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different. But if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful like Ohio. Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? Damn. No. Well, neither have I. But my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are, are, there's something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say except I hope they all rot. I don't, uh, well, maybe a bit. 
but here. Ha! <laughs> if you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. Geez, you got a return letter for him too? My goodness gracious. Here without being seen. Well, I fucking bolted in here, no problem. So unless something changes, I think I could just run my ass right back out. Wow. Now that was sneaky. Look at the rainbow! <gasps> Look at the rainbow! <gasps> Look at that! This place is beautiful. Uh, let's go. can't just leave it at that. Did I actually get like a thing for not getting spotted? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I could have did it even faster too. I thought I did it pretty fast just by running in there and not getting spotted. But then again, I did just get clotheslined by a fucking tree on the way out. So that could have been uh, a problem. You know me, I'm on official business for the family. All right, come on. Yeah, for the family. <laughs> Where the hell is he? <laughs> Fucking destroying their, their hedge maze. <laughs> See in here? What the fuck are you doing? Turn into your horse, huh? You got my money? Sure. Did she give anything? For me? Yes. Might I have it? Sure. How much There's money nothing. is that? God, I'm so sweaty. Ah. Uh, I can't be bothered. Here, take it. Oh, thank you, Arthur. You'll... Thank you. <laughs> Jesus, how sweaty I am. <clears throat> what a woman. She's... What is it, a nudie? This'll get her killed, for sure. What? Women's suffrage. Around here, they don't even like men voting. They'd bring back the monarchy, given half the chance. Progress is a dirty word in these parts. Unlike incest. Excuse me? I don't want to marry Whoa. my cousin Matilda. I want to marry Penelope. But they're gonna... They'll kill her at one of those rallies they're holding. They've done it before. Mister, you gotta help. No, I'm afraid I don't want no part of it. I'll pay. My family, we've still got some money. Fine. That Just dramatic shot. No more running around with letters. Thank you. Come on. We better get going. Are you hot, dude? Because I mean, I'm, I'm burning up in in my coat. I mean, maybe it's just what I'm wearing, but I'm I'm really I'm really sweating. It might be my hair and my beard. It's really hot out here. We'll go around the property and take the road to town. Boy, we went from like fighting off a bunch of lawmen, uh, doing some crazy shit to uh, hand delivering letters, love letters back and forth. Uh, just like within the span of Easy boy, a mission down. or two. I can't be calm. If we don't get there in time, my true love may be shot. If she wants to rally, you gotta let her rally. Well, good as the cause is, I can't let her become a martyr to it. I, I want to marry a flesh and blood woman. Not a statue in her honor. I'm sure oh. they know what they're doing. There! Oh, there's the rally. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, what are you doing here? I cannot let you go through with this. You'll be killed. I'm prepared to die for the cause, Bo. You know that. Do something, please. Do what? Fight this mob, we must be <laughs> Leave me alive. This is no laughing matter, sir. They need protecting from 
certain elements. Mostly my family. Penelope, I beg you. I'll tell you what. Your friend here can drive the wagon for us. It'll allow us to shout all the louder. Hooray! Sure. Miss Calhoun. Miss Calhoun. My friend here says he can drive the wagon. Well, Olive Calhoun. Normally I like to drive myself, but today I feel like a man joining us sends the right message. Well, oh, I God. ain't never been in a protest march before, madam. Well, just treat us like the sheep and the folks attacking us like the wolves, and I'm sure well. you'll feel right at home. Shall we go? <clears throat> All right, ladies. We know our song is a good one, mm -hmm. and we know our cause is a pure one. Yes, ma'am. Let liberty yes, reign. Let's go and let's get you guys. Let's get you guys voting. Wise, housekeepers and daughters, we cook the food and we fetch the water. Singing songs now, now. of freedom and glory. Take us down Main Street, right through town to the steps of the Bank of Absolutely. What was your name? Arthur Morgan. Very good. Why would you say your real name? Not too quick and not too slow. We need them to hear our voice. Well, they'll hear it all right. What the fuck? He gave him the, his real name. Are you an old friend of the movement? I'm just a driver, Mrs. Calhoun. Maybe a shotgun messenger if it comes to it. Well, our message will be delivered peaceably, Mr. Morgan. <laughs> you can one keep that's your just like running out there. Yourself. Whoa, was he trying to throw like shit at them? What was that, Mr. Morgan? What was that? Look at these people. <gasps> Wait, he tried to throw poop at them. I can feel it. I believe you might be right. Good day, Sheriff. I just will make sure it's a peaceful assembly. He's Don't not happy. Give it a rest, you sorry fool. <laughs> Mr. Morgan, I give you the male of the species. Yeah, it's a They're doing specimen, I grant it. Almost there. Take us just a little further, please. Those are the steps, Mr. Morgan. Stop in front there, and then all you need to do is listen. Ladies! Okay. Get down, boys. Come on, Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Go home! Shut your mouth! What are you what doing? Hell is going on? Well, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. this is a great day for all of us. Yeah. For today is the day we begin to live as equals. Equals! Ah. Yes, equal, sir. Fair and equal. This is unnatural. This is nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fair. Equal and free, just as the founding fathers intended. Oh, oh, founding uh -oh. fathers, uh -oh. not founding mothers, you hey, silly old goat. Hey, oh. hey. Oh. Oh. What the hell are you doing here, boy? Keep your voice down. I'm trying to listen to the speech. Hello, darling cousin. Don't you ever speak to me like that. What are you doing here? Listening. I suppose. Go help Bo. His cousin is a moron. And stop them from ruining the speech. You need to learn yourself some manners, cousin. Haven't you got anything better to do? Oh, you always were. Bo, where are we just leaving? Well, who the hell is this? Follow me, Ronnie. Oh, what? You'll hit me? Come on. Sir, can you not see? I'm gonna fucking beat his ass. Come on, Bo. Let's go. Quick now. We gotta go before they think twice. Oh, Lord. Follow me. I know a place. It's an old battlefield no one goes to. Are they following us, or I mean... I might need to <clears throat> put something on. Ha! Look at the... We have built... You don't want to go back and hear the speeches? I ain't voted before, but kind of getting hot for voting rights. I don't know whether to take you seriously, Mr. Morgan. My cousins are my primary concern right now. If everyone knows about Penelope and me... Everyone knows about Penelope and you? 
I know about Penelope and you, and I've been here all of ten minutes. Damn! Sooner it's resolved. Oh, the sooner shit. it's dealt with, you mean? We're dealt with. Our families, the Greys and the Braithwaites, we bury our secrets, and we bury them deep. Your secrets and your treasure? You know, Catherine Braithwaite's got a daughter. No one's seen her in years. She weren't right, you know, and Penelope said... Uh, I, I ain't heard about daughters. I heard about gold. But Yankee gold? I fear that's just a story, Mr. Morgan. But I don't know. I want some of that gold. I had a pretty big payday with that one piece of gold that I got, so if this I could is get some awful. more gold. Nobody died. Ain't that awful. My cousins are vindictive bastards. My brothers are vindictive bastards. My cousins are worse. They started it. I know, but... You should leave. I will, as soon as I have enough money. When my family... We have money, but I don't. Is your family very rich? Yes. Well, I believe so. But, uh, they keep me out of the discussions. I have more of a... artistic temperament, so... Oh, is that what they call it? Yes. Oh, <laughs> you made a joke. I really love her. I do. Well, hey, stick uh... around. Maybe you can die for her as well. I thought you were trying to make me feel better. Look, I gotta go. Me too. Oh, damn! I'm gonna be late. My uncle is quite as bad as you would imagine. Uh, here, your payment. Thank Give me you. the money. Excuse me. How much? Do I, how much do I get? Thirty dollars. That's it. Excuse me. Shouldn't I have gotten like a payment for the start of the mission too? He gave me my payment for the last mission at the start of this mission, and now he just gave me more money. I only got thirty dollars. You cheap. Little fuck! What's this Dutch mission all about? Of course, of course. Oh, and here is my dear friend, Arthur Callahan. Boy, is a hunter. Now I have a different Boy last name again. Boy, is a killer. Arthur, you've met but not been introduced to Mr. Oh, I'm so sorry, Sheriff. Grant. How are you doing, sir? I'm fine. Tough business you boys had. We did? Oh, there's no need to pretend with me, sir. Life can be tough. So it can. And no man owes another anything. No, sir. But still, I feel you were hard done by. Losing your employment like that? But still, what? here in Rhodes, we have work enough for honest men. Oh, that's some strong stuff. Still. Don't seem to be doing you any harm, I guess. Exactly. Whoa. Excuse me a moment. Jesus. I told you we was moving up in this world. Deputies. You have finally <laughs> lost your mind. Amongst these drunkards, hillbillies, and slavers? Good honest thieves like us. We're bound to be more in a place like this. Oh, Sheriff Gray, you are back. Now listen, sir. There is shine in them woods, though, and it is cost in this county its good name and the state a whole lot of income. You boys wouldn't mind rooting it out. Maybe we'll make you permanent. I gotta set me down a second. Not a problem, sir. Not a problem at all. You are in safe hands now. And people waste time with the temperance movement. Liquor never dulled a good man's senses. <laughs> Dude. Arthur, you ride with the deputy. I'm a Bill little deputy. Climb on up. Oh man, why the fuck do I have to like go with him? God damn it. Look, I got a badge. Archibald? I got a real badge. How are you? Pretty good. And your friend is behaving himself? Oh. <laughs> Yes, I think he's learned his lesson. Congratulations on becoming a temporarily deputized citizen of Scarlet Meadows County. Most towns just get <laughs> bounty hunters to do their dirty work these days, but Sheriff Gray believes the law should keep the law. Now, I'm sure I don't need to remind you there's a chain of command here. There is? Dang straight there is. This is a dangerous business, but follow my lead and you'll be just fine. 
Sure. Follow hey. his lead. Archibald wants to remind us he's in charge here. Of course. Who else would be? You were a big help with them Anderson boys, and I put in a very good word with the sheriff on your behalf. We appreciate that. We rounded up the others soon after. I'm pushing for the rope myself, but that's by the by. So, these moonshiners. Not just any moonshiners. Braithwaites. I told you oh. about the Braithwaites. Pretty sure you did. Old Cotton family had a fortune at one point until, well, a few changes in the labor laws. Now they're dealing in moonshine. We found their stills hidden all over Lemoyne. Quick as we destroy one, another <laughs> one pops up. You could call it a pitiful I fall see. from grace, if they had any grace to start with. I have no time for tax dodgers. Not to mention the fact that Catherine Braithwaite has a rather expensive interest in thoroughbred horses to maintain. But I heard something about it being gold these families were fighting over. Well, that's where the fuck the am I looking? Why am I looking all the, the way over there? And the Braithwaites think oh, the there he goes. Stole the fortune from He's him. looking at him. But it happened so long ago, I don't know for sure if it's true. Must be tough being rich, huh? <laughs> so I imagine. That badge rather suits you, Mr. W. Yes. I thought so, too. Does it feel good to be back at it, serving your country? I wouldn't go that far. You see that wagon? What's wrong with that wagon? Want me to get out? What's up with this wagon? There's dead people over here. I can see it on my mini-map. My God! Keep your eyes open. I found a dead person right here. I can't move. He's dead. He's, he's dead. No, this must have happened recently. Oh no, dude! He's purple. I mean, he's he's been there for a while, this dude. Hey, come have a look at this. I mean, he's he's really dead. Been dead for a while. Look, suit and tie, one bullet clean through the forehead. Well, my money says this is the handiwork of a gang called the Lemoyne Raiders. Yeah, I've run into mm. them. Let's see if we've got any identification. Those damn Lemon Raiders. Okay, we should get going. I'll send someone over here later to clean this up. I do hate those guys, those lemon raiders. They're shitheads. <laughs> Wait, what? Am I getting on, why am I getting on my horse? No, I pushed Dangerous over there. Business, the life of a lawman, isn't it? Appear so. Would you mind taking the reins? I want to have a look at these papers. Sure. Sure. I'll direct you. <laughs> sure. Okay. Frederick Mitchell, Lemoyne State Legislator. Poor feller. Yes, this certainly smacks of the Raiders to me. Bunch of ex-army free staters without an ounce of respect for the law. That's seven Damn. government officials they've murdered this year alone. Yep. Not the nicest fellers in my experience. Go right at the crossroads. Oh, and I know the Braithwaites are in business with them. No shame. Trash the Braithwaites are in business with the Lemon Raiders? They're right again here. He had a few stories, let me tell you. Town oh preacher God. and town sheriff. How big does this... To drink a sailor under the table before breakfast. He had one How tiny does the hand rabbit hole like go? a child on the end of a grown man's arm. But anyway, this tells you what kind of people the Braithwaites are. Selling moonshine to murderers. I tell folks don't even speak to him. Don't even look him in the eye. I'm sure some, like, I Sleepy would. Hollow vibes here, we here are. dude. So what was I saying? Something about the Braithwaites, I think. Even saying that word makes me sick. Now, anyone we find here, we bring in alive, understood? Round them up. Damn it. Then take this operation down for good. Come on. Alive? I'm gonna have Let's to fucking punch him in the face. 
Oh, we're sneaking? Okay. <laughs> I'm following your guys' lead here. See? See? What did I, I can't tell see you, boys? Shit. What did I say? Oh. I said this place was crawling with vermin, and we just found ourselves the rat's nest par excellence, as they say in Paris. My aunt, she went to Paris back in 78. Oh, the this. Well, the way I see Actually, let my friend here decide. He doesn't have your fine way with words, but he is definitely the man for the job. What am I gonna do? Arthur and Bill, me and Archibald. You boys want right or left? Uh, I'll we'll take, take left. the left. Let's stop these filthy degenerate tax dodgers. The cheese of a fine idea. Remember what he said. We need them alive. Shut the Let's fuck up, Bill. Like, what the out. fuck are you even Entitled. doing here? Like, you fucked Got up it. every single Deputy fucking mission Williams. that I've been on with you. Why does Bill get a fucking temporary badge, too? Like, who the fuck is Bill? Is that Bill right there? Jesus, what are you doing? Watch him send him. I think you take this one, Bill. With pleasure. Go ahead, Bill. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Damn, what is he doing to him? Jesus Christ. Bill! <laughs> what are you gonna do now? I don't know what you're doing with him, Bill. Where are you taking him? Where are you taking him? What? The hell are you doing? Why is it like he's holding a gun, but he's not? <laughs> Good job, Bill. There's no gun in your hand. Oh look, they got they got two more bodies too. I guess I have to get this one, huh? everybody good work good work everyone just want to say that was that was excellent on everybody's part <sighs> wow Bill still pile, hanging out Arthur. like that sure here you go I think that's it well what do we do now we better destroy all this any of your boys can handle explosives Sure. Anyone but him. Oh, so. I think you're real funny, don't you? Tell me about that. <laughs> that is the last time I'll mention it, I swear. I gotta plant some dynamite. Oh, boy. How many do I get? Eight? Oh, my goodness. Eight of them. Well, I'll be. Am I gonna am I doing it right now? Am I blowing this bad boy up? Ah, ah, ah. Hey! That belongs to the Lamoran Raiders, you sons of bitches! Shit! We got men over here! Lemon Raiders! Oh boy. Oh my god, what happened to that 
guy! How did he just blow up like that? Whoa, my goodness! It's like explosions going off everywhere. Oh my god, I got I, Dude, I, that was like all my ammo. That was literally all my ammo just to do that. <laughs> oh! There we go, I got another gun. I think, it, I think that dude's face is absolutely gone. The, his head is gone. I shot him so many times in the head. His fucking head is gone. Wow. There's a lot of bodies around here. I didn't do all this. Damn, Phil. Oh! Wait, I got ammo? Oh, I got a... Oh, I didn't even know I had express ammo in these bad boys. Well, I'll be. This is gonna be ten times worse for you, buddy. Is that all you got? <laughs> for one guy. Dude, he doesn't, he's, he, like, he has, like, a, like, he has, like, he's got, like, a, like, it, that wasn't even clean off. There's a piece of his head still there. And my Valentino wipe. That's fucking brutal. You missed what I just did. Well done. <laughs> well, forgive me, but me and my man must return to our lives. Ah, seems like we failed to destroy the last of the moonshine. Sure. Would you like us to? Well, I normally take it for personal consumption. It's sort of part of the job. But I better get back home. Why don't I just take a jug or two and leave you boys the rest to show that there's no hard feelings on account of the war? We are all Americans. Of course. But my cousin, Webster, he used to say some of us is not as American as others, if you know what I mean. Only I didn't, quite. Come on, you degenerate no What the fuck are we going to do with the rest? Do we sell it? Kill Billy piece of scum. I know you, Billy Lime. Finally. You've always been a Finally. piece of crap. Come on, Billy we Lime, and he's a part of the Lemon Raiders. So ah, goodness. Backwards. So backwards that even we are like geniuses. <laughs> Bill, get this stuff out of here. Come on, you ride with me. Okay. No, I don't want to. Please, no, Can I don't I want to. This somewhere near camp, Bob? Yes, show it to Hosea. I'm sure he can find a use for it. Bit of trouble back there, Arthur? Ain't there always. From what they was yelling, I think they were the buyers. Old Archibald didn't ask too many questions, so neither should we. I ain't planning to. That was worth the effort, though. Deputized and hiding in plain sight. These lawmen. Where the fuck are we going? Two families. Why are we riding so close I mean, to I each really other? I really think we can play this from all sides. It's got Hosea written all over it. This is starting to sound like the Young Dutch again. What do you mean, Young Dutch? I'm as strong as I have ever been. Hey, you know what? Why don't I race you back? Sure, let's go. Okay, you're on. That's the spirit. Okay, on my word. Set, I'm already going, go. dude. Hey, wait a minute. Your horse is faster than mine. Easy. Oh, bitch. Ah. 
You never ah. were much of a rider. What we'll do you mean? I'm winning. That. I'm winning right now. Fuck. Hey! 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 No rubber banding! Get the fuck back! Why did he drop back so far? He was like really, really far in front of me and then just dropped all the way back. What just happened? I know my my horse needs some drugs. That's what. Oh wait, that's my cocaine. Whoopsie! I just took some cocaine. <laughs> there you go. Ah! Now we spam that shit. I fucking got cocaine. I fucking got my horse on cocaine. Woo! And this motherfucker's nowhere to be. Oh, there he is. He's coming up. He's rubber banding real hard. I've already won, you piece of shit. You're gonna pay me the big bucks too, you piece of shit. I want big money. You really think you can hold that lead? No doubt. I sure hope so. I mean the drugs are real nice. The drugs are helping like wonders. Oh he's cheating. He's cheating, he's cheating, he's cheating. More drugs, motherfucker! I got more drugs! Ah! You're not beating my horse! Cause I'm beating my horse. Ah! I'm running out of drugs. It's wearing off right now. Give me my money. Give me my money. Holy shit. Woo! I never knew you were quite so good at running away, horse. Well, Damn right. The agent slowed you down quite so much. <laughs> well, time is a bastard. When you get to be my age, well, you'll know that better than anything. Be well. I had fun with you today. You're, I was going to say you're like a son to me. But you're more than that. Do I get some money then? Dad? I get some money for winning the race? What the fuck? Hey! Where's my money? Win the race back to camp. That's all I get. You fucking... I used a lot of horse drugs on that race. A lot of horse drugs. You guys have a... Oh, I see it. I see him. I, I saw your balls. I'm trying to study you. <clears throat> I don't think it's balls are real. No! 